We are committed to sharing with you all the secrets of the world and constantly speaking about all the discoveries that are being made. If you are interested in space, history, philosophy and animals, then we will be discussing some of the recent discoveries that have been made within our planet and the solar system. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be discussing research being done on a massive crack in Antarctica, a robot discovering a famous lost shipwreck and the surface of Mars. Huge 100-mile crack appears on one of Antarctica's largest ice shelves. A recent discovery discusses a massive crack that has been found and researched in one of Antarctica's ice shelves. An ice shelf is a giant floating platform of ice that is part of the ocean. Due to being part of the ocean, it doesn't affect the sea level. They are essential to our ecosystems and the Earth as they act like a wall blocking all the ice on land from going into the ocean. One of the world's sea shelves, the Larsen Sea Ice Shelf, has a crack over 100 miles long and 2 miles wide. This is only 20 miles away from becoming the most enormous iceberg ever recorded in human history. The crack has been under evaluation since 2016, and scientists are constantly monitoring it to see any growth or change. For context, one article by geologyin.com notes, that the iceberg would be roughly the same size as Delaware. Ala Kazenda, a geophysicist from NASA, worries that we should be concerned about what this crack may mean for rising sea levels. As we discussed, ice shelves are vital in keeping all the water from inland glaciers out of the ocean. So if they continue to break apart and float away, that water will be released and cause a considerable rise in the world's sea levels. If sea levels rise too much, we will start to experience wetland flooding, destructive erosion and lost habitats for animals and humans, among other devastating consequences. Robot found the long-lost Endurance shipwreck In the early 1900s, an explorer named Ernest Shackleton and his nearly 30-man crew sailed along the icy coast of Antarctica. They were aboard their ship the Endurance. At the time, it was one of the world's most well-designed and incredible ships meant to help explorers reach new areas of the Earth. Unfortunately, things did not quite go to plan, and the ship got caught off the coast and slowly got crushed by the floating ice during their journey. The men on the ship were forced to get off the ship and survive in the Antarctic by hunting penguins and seals for food. Some of the crew members went to look for help, and the others continued to hunt for food and survive. Fortunately, those that set off managed to make it back to an island in the south of Georgia and found help before returning to get the rest of the crew. However, there was no happy ending for the ship. It sunk to the bottom of the ocean and was lost for many years. It was not until recently that an advanced robot named Sabretooth was able to locate the long-lost Endurance shipwreck while exploring the waters in Antarctica. The robot dove nearly 10,000 feet and caught stunning images and videos of the shipwreck. Sabretooth is so interesting because, like the rover on Mars, it has some autonomy and scientists can give it some free range when exploring waters. The robot operators can take control when needed and direct the robot to explore certain places. This is one of the most beautiful and well-preserved shipwrecks in the world as the Antarctic doesn't have trees so there is nothing in the water that has caused the boat, which is made of wood, to break down. Stretch of Molten Rock Discovered Under the Surface of Mars A recent discovery was made of a massive pile of molten rock that spans about 2,500 miles wide below the northern plains of Mars. What makes this discovery so special is that it could possibly contain the ingredients for bugs to exist on the planet. Scientists studying the molten rock revealed that a similar environment exists on Earth, and bugs are able to flourish in them. Additionally, this discovery has driven theories about volcanic activity on the planet, and that there may be deposits of molten lava beneath Mars. However, the volcanism we experience on Earth are due to tectonic plates shifting and bumping into each other. Mars doesn't have tectonic plates, so scientists believe that the events are the result of a mantle plume. 
Mantle plumes are essentially large blobs of warm rock that rise from deep within the planet and push through the layers above them. Once reaching the base, it causes the Earth to fault and create cracks on its surface. This is common on planets like Earth and Venus, which are much warmer, but it's unusual to have been happening on a cold planet like Mars. It has left scientists puzzled and searching for answers. Nonetheless, the mantle that has affected Mars is huge, and researchers will not be able to ignore the fact that it happens and there is much to Mars that we do not yet understand. It could only be a matter of time before more is discovered and we begin to unravel the mysteries that surround Mars. Researchers find a secret warm oasis beneath Antarctica's ice that could be home to undiscovered species. A study of the subglacial caves might reveal undiscovered animal or plant species living comfortably due to the heat of an active volcano. Although average year-long temperatures on Ross Island hover around minus 17 Celsius, including six months between April and September where they do not rise above minus 20 Celsius, the temperature in cave systems beneath the glaciers can reach 25 Celsius. Located around and beneath Mount Erebus, an active volcano, the caves have been hollowed out after years of steam travelling through their passages. The study of the caves, led by the Australian National University, evolved into an analysis of the soil within. Fraser revealed that it contained traces of DNA from algae, mosses and even small animals that could be living in the underground oasis. Most of the DNA, Fraser admits, is like that of species living on the surface. However, not all the sequences studied could be linked to a particular animal or plant group, meaning Fraser may be on the cusp of discovering new life forms as well. Because there are several active volcanoes in the Antarctic, co-researcher Charles Lee from the University of Waikato in New Zealand said similar unexplored subglacial cave systems could exist across the continent. The research, originally published in the international journal Polar Biology, said there are another 15 volcanoes in Antarctica that are currently active or suggest signs of recent activity. We don't know yet just how many cave systems exist around Antarctica's volcanoes, or how interconnected these subglacial environments might be," he said. Co-author Laurie Connell, a professor from the University of Maine, shared her colleague's excitement but said the DNA evidence doesn't prove anything. The next step is to explore the caves themselves, hoping to find the living proof the team needs. If they exist, it opens the door to an exciting new world. For millennia, humanity has been defined and shaped by the world around us. As the natural world grows and evolves, so too do we as a species. Looking back, it is incredible to see how far we have come. Looking forward, who knows what other exciting discoveries and changes lie in store. What do you think about the discoveries that we discussed in this video? Be sure to let us know in the comment section below and help us grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.